Hey guys, so I'm sorry I'm making this video like way later. I intended to make this so much sooner, but I've been so busy. I don't know if you guys saw on social media, but I have my own hair extension line. I have a clothing line coming out. I have an EP coming out. I've just been so crazy busy and I haven't had the time to just sit down and do a haul, especially after my birthday. I know you guys thought I was gonna do a birthday vlog and I'm sorry I didn't, but this year I just wanted to be a little different. I actually am gonna show you all the things that I got for my birthday. It's not much, it's not what you guys would expect. I told my parents, please don't buy me anything I don't need anything I just want a family party with our boyfriends and their parents and our grandparents and our friends and their parents I just wanted a big like homey family party in our backyard and that is exactly what we had so I had probably the best birthday in my entire life I thought 21 was my best party but I think 23 is definitely I can't believe I just said 23 hold up before I film this I totally thought I turned 22 oh my god age is just a number I'm very very young at heart I like to say I'm 19 at heart because the woman I turned into when I was 19 years old I have not changed from I'm still the exact same person maybe like 17 and 18 I was a completely different person actually I'd say yeah 1920 I'm gonna be stuck there probably all of my 20s and 30s I'm not gonna change I don't like the concept of growing up I don't like when people try to age me I don't like when people try to tell me to have babies because I do not want babies anytime soon and you know what I'm getting off topic I'm gonna get right into this haul but yeah this is my birthday haul for my 23rd birthday so as you guys know I love 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 fashion nova and they were so kind enough this year to gift me with a box for my birthday so thank you fashion nova this is probably my favorite gift i've ever received just a bunch of awesome clothes in one like oh it's amazing i'm gonna be linking fashion nova down below in case you don't know what that website is it's my favorite website so i'm gonna show you guys the outfits so the first thing that i opened was this shirt and you guys know how i feel about pussy bow is that what they're called sorry that sounds really crazy a pussy bow shirt okay so this is what it looks like it's super pretty i'm obsessed with it it's kind of standard for the kind of shirt that i wear but my favorite part about the fashion nova shirt is that it has like these lines that go up like a very old-fashioned shirt with ruffles and all of my pussy bow shirts do not have that victorian lining and stitching and ruffles like this so that's what makes this my favorite pussy bow shirt you guys know i own like a million of these but this is my all-time favorite one and i also got these plaid high-waisted bell-bottom pants you guys know i am not a pants girl but give me a pussy bow shirt and i am a pants girl i wear pussy bow shirts with like flowy skirts skorts pencil skirts and pants and shorts i wear them with everything but this is my favorite look i have never owned form-fitting pants that are high-waisted and flare out like this actually i don't think i've owned pants other than jeans in a really long time so this is a moment right now but this is probably the cutest outfit that i've worn in a long time so i'm obsessed with that so this is the next shirt that i got i love this so much i feel like it's my instagram in a shirt it's blush and it's lined in black and it has ruffles and it ties in a cute little unfinished bow in the center i love when a shirt has like a spaghetti strap but then like a flowy chiffon ruffle on the shoulder i feel like that's so princessy and like this is truly a beautiful shirt I love it so much and I just paired it off with some black flowy shorts that I already own now I know you guys probably have all seen these in my wardrobe before but I promise these are different you guys know I love like feathery faux fur heels I lost my black faux fur heels like at Beautycon was it? I think I brought them to Beautycon and I lost them and I miss them so much So Fashion Nova was kind enough to send me these and I actually like these better because I get more height on these You guys know I'm really short those of you who met me know I am probably shorter than you that won't happen in these heels These are a good like four inches. They're velvet. They're nice and they're lined in like this pretty gold I don't know I just feel like this is like a new and improved version of the shoes that I lost and there's like this cute platform Like in the front so you pretty much have height all over so yeah, I got these new babies your girl never ever ever buys denim and when I say never I mean never but then there comes a point in time where I'm looking through my closet and I'm like I need denim shorts or I need jeans and so this was the perfect time to receive denim shorts it's springtime it's about to be summer so I got these cute denim shorts from Fashion Nova these are so Nikki I feel like the little rips and everything and she's always wearing denim shorts so I feel like I'm just gonna be trying something different this summer I'm gonna try to stay away from like the skirts so much and kind of lean towards denim shorts I just feel like I am so girly and that's always gonna be a part of me but like when it comes to summertime and like looking cute come on you gotta wear some denim shorts so I got this Tiffany blue romper look how cute it's like the material of a beach cover-up so I feel like you could wear this to work out or go running because I feel like it's somewhat sweat proof or you could wear it as like a beach cover-up I think I would wear it as a pajama honestly it's really comfortable and it's so adorable I feel like it would look so cute at like a sleepover or something but yeah it looks like this 
I also got these blush pink gladiator sandals. Pom poms and like tassels and all that stuff have been in lately, so I thought I would go for these like faux fur tassels on these gladiator shoes. In the summertime, I'm always having trouble like finding what to wear on my feet other than heels or like sandaled heels because in the winter time, you guys know my go-to shoes are Uggs or Ugg slippers, like my little blush ones with the bows on the back. But in the summertime, it's kind of hard. Like all my rubber flip-flops break anyway, so I rather wear structured gladiator shoes because I know they're not gonna break on me. So I kind of trust these more like when I go on vacation or go out, you know what I mean? These aren't gonna break right here and leave you shoeless on one foot in the middle of like a public mall, so. This next outfit is black, but it's actually my favorite from the whole box. It's so beautiful. It looks like this. I feel like it's very European. I wanna say French. Like to me, I could see myself wearing this in front of the Eiffel Tower, but I could also see myself wearing this in Milan, <laughs> acting like I've been to these places. <laughs> but yeah, it's really pretty. I could see myself with a really pretty like top knot or like Louboutins or something in this. I just feel like it's so chic, like a row of pearls. Wait, it's kind of like giving me Audrey Hepburn vibes. I love the ruffles, it's super ruffly. And I love tulle ruffles. I think that's so genius. I think that's what reminds me of like a Parisian style, like ruffles and tulle. You know how they do like the thing around the neck. And the shoes that I'm wearing with that romper are these adorable pearl heels. I actually wanted them in pink, but I'm glad I didn't because these came in the mail and like they automatically go with a bunch of outfits. Like even my cream outfits, I feel like these pearls tie into. I feel like pink might be a little tacky with like a super chic champagne and cream and silk outfits that I would wear these with. So yeah, I feel like this is more of a, like a mature take on these pearl heels and they're so cute and they're velvet and they got this fringe going on right here. I just feel like they're super stylish. I really like them. Last but not least, I got these slip on sneakers. These are my favorite, I think actually. I take that back. These might be my favorite because they have these little flowers all over them and they so remind me of the Marc Jacobs perfumes and you guys know I love Marc Jacobs. I love like the whole flower look. Like the dress I wore at the Bellamy launch party had the flowers on the sleeves. Here, I'll go get it. This had like flowers on the sleeves and the reason I like this was because it reminded me of Marc Jacobs. I have never seen sneakers that look like this. They're so cute. These are definitely my favorite. So now we're done with clothes and the next present I got is this fresh cream lotion from Philosophy. I've already used like a lot of it and the fresh cream perfume. If you guys like anything that smells like vanilla or cupcakes or cake batter or marshmallows or anything in that category, this is the fragrance for you. Colin's mom turned me on to this and I'm so obsessed with it. Like thank you Lori. Oh my god. Best smell I've ever used so a few of my friends put their money together and got me Chanel earrings, so thank you those of you who did this. I feel like earrings was the thing this year. One of my friends got me Givenchy earrings too this year. That That's sitting in Pennsylvania. I'm in my LA apartment, so this is whatever I brought in my suitcase with me. I also received a bunch of Bath & Body Works goodies from Colin's mom, so thank you again. Thank you. Gosh, she's an awesome woman. <laughs> but these were the Chanel earrings that a few of my friends got me. They all pitched their money in and got me these really cute ones. I feel like if I got these like the night that we all went out I would have worn these oops so cute they would have made awesome birthday pictures but I didn't get them till like the day after these are so glam I love them so pretty 